to know all about Flipkart seller processes, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss any update from us. Hello sellers. Today we will learn about the process of adding a listing on the Flipkart Seller Hub app. Now you can list your products from anywhere, anytime. To start the process of creating your first listing on the mobile app, please click on the Flipkart Seller Hub app Log into your account using your credentials and follow the simple step-by-step -step process. Click the hamburger menu icon on the left corner of the screen. Click on the listing option. Please read the introduction carefully and click on get started. We have divided the creation method into two sections, my listing and in progress listing. Let's learn more about my listing tab. These listings have already cleared all the QC checks and are live on the platform. Also, listings that are out of stock or have been inactive due to any error will be reflected under this tab. Next, we come to the In Progress Listing tab. The following are the listings that come under this tab. These are the listings that are in progress but are not yet live. The listings that have labels like QC failed QC in progress or saved as a draft in draft mode. These are the listings that have passed the QC check but are not yet live on the platform. Now it's time to create a listing. Simply follow these steps. Click on the add listing floating tab in the my listing or in progress listing tab. You can choose to add your listings either under Flipkart or Shopsy specific verticals. Here, you can either latch on to an existing listing by mentioning the product title, SKU or FSN ID on the search bar or click on Create New Listing. This process is further divided into three stages. Select Vertical, Select Brand and Product Information. Let's learn more about Select Vertical, shall we? Sellers can select the appropriate verticals at this stage. Certain verticals fall under government mandates such as nuts, ready-to-make products, etc. Such products require approval from the Food Safety and Standards Association of India FSSAI. Click on Apply Brand Approval and upload the necessary documents for such listings. Now, select the correct vertical options and take the listing process forward. To help you understand select vertical option better, let us select the vertical as coolers. Click on confirm and next. Next is select brand. Here you have to enter the brand name and check for brand approval by clicking on check brand button. If you already have brand approval for the given brand, it will direct you to a page with the option to confirm and next. Please note that in the case of non-branded products, brand approvals will not be required. Click on View Flipkart's Image Guidelines and you will be redirected to the generic image guidelines that need to be followed for all listings. Make sure to double check them. The next stage is Product Info. Enter the following details. Product Description, Stock, Pricing Information, Upload the product images. You will get a chance to upload the product image by clicking on the Upload Photo option. Please ensure to go through all the image guidelines before uploading the images as they may vary from vertical to vertical. You can choose to take a picture or upload from the gallery. This helps you to click a picture directly from a mobile phone without any hassle you will be able to identify the mandatory picture with the asterisk sign. Now enter the price, stock and shipping information for the product. The seller can either click on the save button to save the listing as a draft or click on the send to QC button. Here you will receive a message that listing has been created successfully. The status of the listings can be tracked on the product create request option under the In Progress Listing tab. All the listings with the QC failed filter will have the option to fix errors. The listings that are pending as drafts will have a continue option. 
Now your listing process is complete. Important note, all listings with the QC Pass filter will have the view option to view the listing. If you wish to make any changes to your live listings, they will be reflected under the product edit request page. If you wish to delete a listing, you can go to the three dots located at the top right corner and delete the listing. You will get a window to confirm your deletion request. Click on delete option. A green pop-up will appear with the message listing deleted successfully and undo options. Next is what happens if the QC check fails? If your product has failed the QC check, you have to follow these steps. Click on Product Create Request under the In Progress Listings tab. Click on Fix Errors. You will be redirected to the Listing Errors page. The errors can be identified with the red exclamation mark for all attributes. All the attributes along with the error number would be reflected on top. If there are generic errors common to all the attributes, those would be shown in detail. In case you need to edit the product images, choose the product image by clicking on Upload from Gallery or Take a Picture option. Upload the correct product image. Once you fix all the errors, the Send to QC button will be enabled. You will get a green pop saying, Listing has been sent to QC successfully. Now let's learn about how to edit my listings on the app if they are already live. Follow the steps to edit your live listing. Go to your Flipkart Seller Hub app and log in with your credential. Click on Listing option from Hamburger menu. Click on the Active Listings option. Now select a particular listing under the My Listing page you will be able to see all your live listings here. Select a live listing that needs to be edited and scroll down to click on the edit option under the catalog attribute. You will get options like replacing the product image, updating the price and shipping information. Once you make all the changes, click on the send to QC option for a QC check. You will receive a message on your screen that reads Listing sent to QC successfully. In case you wish to save the listing as a draft, please click on Save. You can check your draft anytime under the Product Edit Request tab. Important note, the Variant Creation option is not yet available on the app. We advise you to open the Seller Dashboard on your PC to create more variants of the same product. Flipkart Seller Hub is always there to make your business life easier and happier. Do not forget to share your love by hitting like, commenting and sharing this informative video with your other seller friends. Subscribe to our channel and keep watching and learning with us.